welcome to Wow Body Now. Today is all about how to get a bigger butt at home. Now that being said, there's two very important things to keep in mind. Number one, if you are trying to build muscle mass, for example, build a bigger booty, you need to make sure you're eating the proper amount and type of calories. Often, I work out fasted in the morning just because I wake up and I want to go. But if you're trying to build a bigger butt or gain a little bit more mass and build your muscles a little bit more, then I do not suggest working out fasted. You want to eat a good breakfast with some good healthy carbs and some lean protein in it. You can see that I had a bowl of oatmeal and a big old bowl of steamed vegetables for my breakfast today. And then you want to eat, again, some good carbs and some lean protein after you're done your workout. Um, I'm going to have some egg whites and some cinnamon sweet potatoes after my workout. So, keep that in mind. You need to be eating the right amount. When you are exercising at an intense level and really working hard to get um, toned, to get to build muscles that you want, you need to eat to support that. Number two, the fastest, best way to build a bigger booty is to lift heavy. If you have access to a squat rack or to go to a gym and you have somebody that's ready to spot you, the fastest way to build your booty is to really go heavy using that squat rack, using heavier weights, okay? If you can, do that if you're really serious about building a bigger booty. Now, if you're still serious about building a bigger booty, but really all you have time and access to is yourself and what you have at home, then this workout is for you. So that we can go heavier with our body weight, all right, during some exercises, during most of the exercises, we're focusing on one leg exercises, all right, so that most of our, or all of our body weight is focused on one side, so that it's like we're going heavier. We're going the heaviest we can. At other times, you just get the heaviest thing you have. The heaviest weight I have here is my 30-pound sandbag. And we're going to focus that on one side of the body again to, to go heavier for that one side instead of dividing it up over both legs and both butt cheeks, right? All right, so keeping that in mind, that's the idea of today so that you can start to build a bigger booty if you want. I want you to pause the video now and get warmed up, five minutes of some general exercises to get your muscles warm and all that good stuff. I'm running out of camera battery, so I'm not going to record my warm up. So pause right now, go get warmed up. advanced move. If you need to use a chair, grab a chair and check the corner. That's going to show you what the modified version is for beginners, all right? Otherwise, we're going to do 10 pistol squats on each leg. It's going to work your flexibility too. Ready? Here we go. One. Two. Three, you're really working that standing leg. Four. Five. Six. Go. Seven. What? Eight. Nine. Ten. All right, other side. Whew. You see I switched cameras because I had less battery than I thought my other camera ran out. All right, here we go. One. Just take your time. Two. 
three. Four. your heaviest weight. Maybe it's hand weights that you have. Maybe you have a sandbag. Maybe you have a Yugi ball. Maybe you don't have anything and that's fine. So I'm loading your right side here. We're going to do a 90-10 squat. Your left leg, your toes are up. It's just there for balance. 90% of your weight is already on this leg. All right, plus the added weight. You ready? Just a regular squat. Go down. Up and push your hips forward, okay? Squat back. Up and push your hips forward. Get as low as you can. Three. Four. Five. Six. Woo! Seven. Eight. Nine, ten. Keep that the same way. Take that left leg back. We're going to lunge with a knee drive. All right. Go one, drive it up. Two, Ooh, nice and balanced. Three, four. Step back wide. Five. See how much distance I have? Six, so get low. Seven. So push the hips forward, squeeze that foot. Eight. Nine. Ten. Beautiful. All right, switch it to the other side. 90 10 squats. Now your right leg. You have popped the toes, 90% of that weight on your left leg. You ready? Go as deep as you can. One. Two. Now if you're trying to build your butt, if you can get your butt below knee level, past 90 degrees, that's better. Four. Because it takes a little bit off the thighs, Five and engages the butt a little bit more. Abs tight. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. All right, we're gonna lunge back. Okay, here we go. One, you got it. Two, three, don't bang this knee. It barely touches it at all. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Beautiful. Okay, so put your weight down. We're going to finish the round with some lateral jumps, ending in a single leg squat, okay? So you want to powerfully jump to the side, or leap to the side, I should say. Land on one foot, go down. Don't let that foot touch in the, don't let that foot touch in the back, touch the ground. There you go. One, two, we're doing 30, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 10, 11, 12, 13, 
13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, make it explosive, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, oh, sip your water, round one is done, let's do it again, you can sip some of my water, put it up there when you're done, all right, 10 pistol squats, we're going to start on the other leg this time, okay, let's go, we want to keep that heart rate up, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Do this. Here we go. One, two, three. My knees pop and crack the whole time. Okay. Four, five. I'm feeling heavier. <sighs> Seven. Eight. Seven, eight, nine, 
eight, nine, ten. All right, lunge with the knee drive. Ten, nine, push your hips forward to the top, squeeze that tush. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, come on, ah, two, one. Okay, here are our 30 whew, lateral hops with a single leg squat. It looks like skaters, right? Here we go. 30, 29, keep going. right there on your hips. Okay, if you don't have anything, it's okay. I just want you to squeeze your booty extra. All right, we're going to push up. There we go, we're gonna go one, two, give me 10 of them. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Squeeze extra at the top, nine, 10. Hold it up there, cross the other leg over, same thing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Cross the other leg over. Give me ten of them. You got it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten. Finish with 20 both legs. Ready? Push it up high. There you go. Squeeze that tush. Here we go. For 20, 19, 18, 17. Sweat, sweat is dripping. <laughs> 15, 14, 13. Really dig into those heels. 12, 11, 10, 9, Eight, seven, whew, six, five, four, three, two, hold it up there. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, <coughs> five, four, three. Oh my goodness, the burn. It feels so good. Okay, bring it down. Push that over to the side. Oh. <sighs> Quick little stretch here in a bit, baby. Me, I want you to show you something. We're going to show you at the end. Okay. Coming over to your plank. All right. This is getting the upper body in just a little bit because I always like to have a little bit of upper body if it's lower body focused. And I love to do that with planks. So I'm really getting the core engaged too. Even though the core has been engaged the whole time with squats, you really do use your spinal muscles, your obliques, and your abs during squats, especially when you focus on one leg. Anyway, you've already been holding that perfect plank with me, right? And let's just do some leg lifts. 10, nine, squeeze that tush. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, other leg. 
10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Hold it. Ready? Just hold that perfect plank. Squeeze those abs. Finish, finish, finish with the perfect plank. Now, Madison is getting unhappy. I think you can hear her. So, I want you to do this mat work session one more time through. <sighs> with me, I'm probably just gonna replay the first one so that, well, she seems kind of happy now. Let's try to go again. Let's try to see how far we can get. All right. Here we go, press it right there. Let's go. Give me 10, nine, eight, seven, oh my goodness, six, five, four, three, two, one. Cross the leg over. Give me 10, nine, squeeze the tush, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, other side we go. Oh, come on, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, 20 with both legs. Here we go, really squeeze it at the top. 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, really engaging those abs at the same time. Nine, I feel it. Eight, seven, six, five, oh my goodness. Four, one, three, two, one. Squeeze extra at the top, beautiful. Throw it out of the way. Get on over, forearm plank. Just make sure you have that perfect form. Abdominals in, butt is squeezing. Upper body nice and firm and tight. Let's do 10 leg lifts. One, two, three. Squeeze that tush. Four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten. Other leg. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hold that perfect plank. Come on. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Oh. Oh. What about now? Oh. All right, don't go anywhere. Mia wanted to show you something special that we do. All right. So really, my heaviest weight in the house is not my sandbag. It is Mia. She fluctuates between 48 and 50 pounds. And she likes to let me use her sometimes. So we can squat Mia. Gotta give even, right? Yeah. Okay, ready? Here we go. Wee. 